Hello, welcome back. This is Marion Pachilia, your sixth grade social studies teacher. In this video, we're going to talk about how to add your peers to follow you on Blogger. Well, the first thing you knew, need to do is connect. You're going to be in the folder connecting with Blogger. That's how you're watching this video. Yes, the video will be hyperlinked right into here. All right. You have to open up the responses from the email forum by clicking this link. You click on the link, it opens up a spreadsheet. This is what's a spreadsheet. You have rows and you have cells and all that wonderful stuff that you're going to use later on in other classes. However, for the purpose of what we're doing here, I will show you by modeling how to add your peer's email address. I am now going to say I'm in first period. You have your blogger window open. Okay. When you're in blogger, you can have many different blogs. However, the main one we are using for the class is your social studies learning log or your sixth grade and your name social studies learning. You click on the link one more time just in case. Back up. Click on your link. Very good. It opens it up into your overview page. From here, I can view my blog or I can do new posts. I can look at the posts I currently have. Say I'm still editing. I haven't posted it yet. It still shows here. Um, all these wonderful things. But this video is teaching you now how to add friends so they can follow you. S or your posts are just very one free one person. It's kind of boring in that sense. Come down to your settings, the very bottom. Under layout, under templates, settings. In your settings, you can add descriptions. You can do edit your title if you didn't like it, I guess. Your blog address, I think you have to keep it close to the same as you started up with. Um, nevertheless, what we need to do down here is look at the blog readers. Because you are private. Only the readers listed below can read your blog. Well, let's add readers. Before I do that, make sure. If you opened that up the link, you could have been public. But that means you're above 13 and Rosa is snoring. You could be private. Only the blog authors can see it. Private. Only these readers can see it. Well, we're going to add our classmates so that they can follow us along in the blog by following it on private. I'm going to add readers. That opens up a box here. I could go in one by one and copy and paste, but that is going to take you some time. So let's do this as called a batch loading. Sorry for this background noise of Rosa. All right, I'm going to click on the first email in my class period. Here's my first period. This is the cell that I want you to click on if your first period would be Olivia's. Now, first period, we're going to have more people sign up, so you'll have more emails to add later. Just letting you know. The last person that signed in yesterday was Addison's email. So I'm going to hit my shift button and hold it. Then I'm going to click on Addison's email in the cell B10. That now highlighted all of those cells. We're going to copy it. Remember your friend, the copy command? Remember the keystroke, Control-C. 
that will copy what you have highlighted into what's called a clipboard. When you're ready then, you paste it by pushing Control V. So I Control C from here. It's in the clipboard. You don't see the clipboard, but it's there. Go back to your blogger. In that box, push Control V. Well, you're not quite done. What you need to do at this point is click the button that says Choose from Contacts. What it just did was turn all of those lists of people into an email address. So now the machine recognizes them as being emails. Say select and it's reformatted my box here showing them with a comma after the end of each of them. And say save. Okay. Now I have eight open invitations. Those people just got an email from me inviting them to follow me on my blog. Okay, one more time. You started here. You clicked on that link. It opened up a spreadsheet. You find your first person their email address in your class period. You goes you use your curse you don't use your arrows but you just mouse down until you see the last one. Don't click anything yet. You have to push the shift button first and hold it. Now push click on the last name there. Okay, control, what was the copy command? Yes, control C. Control C, go to blogger, add readers. We're going to go down into your box, push command or control V. Remember, control V. Now I have my big long list. I hit choose from contacts. It's turned my list now into email addresses. That's what this kind of indicate. Sit select my little box here has been reformatted again and hit save changes. This time looking at my invitations I have 32 open invitations. So now 32 people total have received an email from me. Okay. Yes of course Miss Pagilia will select them all and email them all out to you guys. However you do not have to. But let's say you want to follow a blog from somebody else. Maybe your friend in another class period. That's easy. Just open up their, click on their email here, command or control C, copy it, and in your blogger the little thing to add readers, you're going to go down here to the bottom box and Command V. There it is. Okay, hit Choose from Contacts and Save. Piece of cake, right? I hope so. That means the next part would be you have to check your emails and up oh, there's Daisy. Okay, you check your emails, and there's one. You'll get an invite like this. You have to accept it. 
it opens oops that was an error one so let's go back to my email oh and there goes gypsy walking across the floor okay accept your invitation and there you go you're seeing your friends list if you wanted to save that web address and add it to your reading list it's really easy you copy again go to your dashboard and add it to your reading list copy paste copy paste it's very simple all right and since the animals are telling me it's bedtime that is it for tonight Thank you for following along and learning how to add your peers to allow them to follow you on Blogger. Don't forget to accept your friends' requests and enjoy. A lot of really cool blogs are getting finished out there. Have a great night.